long-term process. It's not just about competing. A hard route, this motivates me. That I didn't know about. Big shoulder move. For 500 meters, the hardest climb I ever climbed. It's hard. My name is Matteo Polana. I'm a freelance photographer and filmmaker. I'm uh, Stefano Gisolfi. I'm a professional climber. It rained a lot in the last couple of days, so we were looking for something dry. So today we, we met in Arco and we went to Massone. Uh, Arco is uh, pretty famous uh, in, uh, in climbing. This period for Arco is uh, not the best because it, it rained a lot. So uh, we had to find a dry crack and uh, Abissi is, uh, is the best one in uh, Massone because uh, it's uh, a bit steep and uh, it, it never gets really wet. I, I climbed uh, this uh, 8A called uh, Red Rocks and I already climbed before and uh, I think it's one of the most aesthetic line uh, of the crag because it's uh, on the corner and from there you can see the, the lake and the, all the town of, uh, of Arco. Uh, here in Arco, in a crag uh, close to here, there is a, a new project that is a, a hard, uh, it's a harder version of a hard 9B. So it could probably be uh, from 9B plus to 9C. I tried uh, for a week this year. Uh, I didn't spend uh, much time because uh, I was involved in the uh, competition, but uh, and now that I'm a bit, I have a bit more time, it's uh, completely wet and it's going to be cold. So it's a long-term project, I think, and I like to spend more time on it. And uh, I think uh, it will be like something, uh, one of the hardest things in the world. I started as a climber and when I started climbing I immediately started, I don't know even why, I started also taking pictures. I started traveling with those climbers, I had fun with them because then an athlete became immediately your friend. <laughs> <laughs> Sei fuori, madonna, vedo la luna! <laughs> che stronzo! I, I, I was having fun, so for me they were friends, not, not athletes or something like that. I think that the progression that I did as a photographer or a filmmaker was normal, I would say, but it was made by possibilities, you know, from people that believe uh, in your perspective, let's say, but that gives you the possibility to experience as a photographer. <laughs> yeah, if there, if I, I motivated by the by the challenge, by the a uh, hard route and uh, how I can like search new beta or search something that feels for me and uh, how I can improve on the route, the, that, that's motivates me. What really drives me is to have a nice shot but with a, let's say, a long-term process to come to it. Like if I have to take a really good picture in the mountains, you all know that you have a long approach, you have to climb maybe for 500 meters or whatever. Yeah, sure, the, the process is, uh, is everything. Then the goal, is, if you reach the goal, then it's better. But <laughs> even if you don't reach it, uh, you, you kind of uh, feel better after because you're uh, improved, you're uh, a better climber and maybe a better person, I don't know. 
So the experience that drives you to arrive at that shoot, it's more important than the shoot itself.